What's up guys, today we're going to be opening up some mail from you guys and I know there's going to be some epic stuff because you guys always send some really great stuff. So before we get started the giveaway for this video, I'll be giving away these three cards, Ritual Beast, Tamer Elder, Secret Rare, MX Saber Invoker, and Uria, Lord of Searing Flames. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know your favorite piece of mail. Alright, let's go ahead and hop into it because there is a lot. This isn't even everything. So we're going to go ahead and start. First of all, we have... A DB1 Pecanio Moth. So that's a great start. DB1 Pecanio Moth. This is from Leslie Ramirez. So thank you, Leslie Ramirez, for the Pecanio Moth. Very epic. Good start to our viewer mail. By the way, here's my P.O. box if you want to send something in to be opened on the channel. You guys can go ahead and do that. All right, let's. Uh, we got some cardboard here. So that's what we got. I'm going to kind of try and open this without damaging anything. A little dangerous. Oh, no. Okay, I think it went okay. Okay, I think it went okay. We're doing all right. Oh, what is it? What is this? What is this? What is this? I don't know what this is. Dual Masters. Oh, okay. Okay, for Dual Masters. You're pale. Seeker of the Sunlight. Angry Maple Tree Folk. Rothus the Traveler. Mighty Shouter. Your Pale, Seeker of the Sunlight. Mighty Shouter. Visor of Hope. Rothus the Traveler. Rothus the Traveler. Aqua Hulkus. Rothus the Traveler. And Mongrel Man. Okay. All right, next thing. We have an envelope. All right, so we, uh, we ripped the letter. That was not intended. <laughs> That is why you use the letter opener and don't just rip it. Let's see what the damage is. <laughs> it's all folded up now. Okay, okay, it was just the border. We're all good. All right, there's my P.O. box, Ruxin34. Hey, Ruxin, Luke here writing to you all the way from Sunderland in the UK. That's pretty cool. Love your channel, man. Hope you're well and are living through some uncertain times at the moment, buddy. Not sure how it is in the USA, but over in the UK, a lot of people have been losing their jobs due to COVID. Luckily, I'm safe, though. I've been... Finishing my shifts at work and diving into your channel, it's a great way to escape from everything that's going on at the moment. Particularly like your McDonald's pack opening. Me too. That was a lot of fun. That was awesome. I can't believe you pulled five Millennium Shields. How sick. I would really love to see you open a first edition Strike of Neos booster box in your channel. I absolutely love that. That would be awesome. Yes, it would. That would be cool to do at some point. Thank you, Luke, for sending that. I hope everything's going okay over in the UK. I'm doing all right so far. I mean, you know, as good as you can do right now. But let's see what he sent us. He sent us some cards. Mechlord. Oniros. Got some. Oh, wait. Okay. Are these double sleeped? Okay. This one. Okay. These are. So, looks like we got some pretty epic cards here. Reactor Slime. So, these are some Legendary Duelist 7 cards. So, then we got some more. Some more cards from Rage of Raw, which. We opened a decent amount of it, but compared to like Battles of Legend, we didn't open as much as we did there. So thank you, Luke, for sending me these cards. Pretty epic. Thanks for the note as well. Sorry I ripped it. Not on purpose. Okay, next thing. We have a bubble mailer. Let's let's do it from the top. Let's not rip any more notes. This one's from oh oh no. I have a sneaking suspicion. This one's from Nicholas. Who needs DDS when you can have an army? Your pal. Third rate. Oh man, what could it be inside? How do I get it? How do you even open this thing? Oh, there it is. Okay, I, I see, I see. What did he send us? Oh man, uh oh. All right, we got Metal Raiders. Metal Raiders, Metal Raiders, Metal Raiders, Metal Raiders. Bacano Moss, they're all these different prints. Look how different they look. That's pretty funny. Okay, you can't really tell like that. Uh, maybe it's harder to tell on the camera. Okay, that's a European one. A one, two, three European. One, okay, let's see how many total. One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven Pequeno Moths. We gotta have a, a PSA 10 cannon in here, right? You know, you know what I'm saying? Pequeno Moth. That is pretty awesome. Thank you for sending those. We're gonna have like a duel. Pequeno Moth versus, <laughs> versus Chicolates to see the greater, more powerful one. All right, next we have, let's see. This one's from Dimitri, okay. From Yu-Gi-Oh, dude. Last time, if you guys remember, he sent us that crazy custom card with the uh, Scarlight Red Dragon Archfiend. It looks like he may have sent us 
another custom card. Two, there's two. So let's let's go ahead and not spoil it. Let's check out the note first. Ruxin, 34 in Roman numerals, but fancy. Okay. Congrats on all the success on the channel growth. Feels like the 10K special was yesterday. Yeah, it really does. And here you are at 30. Crazy. Keep up the great work. We're all enjoying the journey. Here are a couple of gifts to help celebrate. Third rate collector and Yu-Gi-Oh! Dude 42. Wait. Both of y'all sent this? I'm so confused. Yu-Gi-Oh! Dude 42 and third rate collector. I'm confused. Okay. Team Instagram rules. Check them both out on Instagram. Team Instagram does rule. Instagram, make sure you guys, if you're not on Instagram, get on there. I'm telling you, it's fun. I know this. I know this packaging. This is how we package the Scarlight. So I have a feeling that this is going to be some custom cards. And I have a feeling that I might have a guess at what they are going to be. Here we go. We have two specific, appears to be 3D cards. Put your guesses in the comments. What could they be? Oh, what is this? This was just to cover it probably, right? Yeah, these were just, uh, you know, to uh, not spoil it, keep it packaged. All right, so we got those cards. What could the first one be? Oh, the epic Pequeno Moth 3D. Check it out. This guy is definitely going to have to hang out in the background at some point this is gonna be amazing i don't know about you guys i kind of have an inkling of what the next the next one's gonna be oh yeah oh yeah 3d in the case what could this one be i have no idea yeah it's a joke i have a great idea i have a great idea what this is gonna be all right these are just extra packaging what could this be oh the great and powerful a chocolate, chicken chocolates, chocolate, chicken chocolates, 3D chocolates on the chocolates. Yes. 3D chocolates. This is incredible. We got this we got the package from Gamers Dreamland earlier with the chocolates mat. Now the 3D chocolates. Team chocolates or team pequeño moth, let me know in the comments. Whew. Yeah, after seeing those 3Ds, it makes it tough. Okay, yeah, this is this is a pretty cool purchase here. We have not one, the Sacred Card Sealed Game, GBA Advanced, not color game, not two, but we have three sealed copies of the Sacred Cards. So now I have four total. Maybe we should open one up for a video and try and get some uh, sealed promos, maybe get tins on them. Maybe we can do like, I'm thinking I open them and then I send it a PSA and then when they come back then I like put that in the same video. What do you guys think? That would probably be pretty fun, you know? Look at them, see how they're, I think they'll grade, send them in, and then we do like the opening and the grading in the same video. I think that would be pretty cool. Let me know what you guys think about that in the comments. And he also sent something. We have the surprise. Okay, the surprise, what could it be? Will you pull PSA 10 worthy blank? I don't know, will I? I don't know what the blank is, so that's the problem here. So I can't really guess. I'm going to guess yes, we will. All right. College student deals on Instagram. Four promos inside. This was a mail-in only promo pack featuring cloning, Blast Sphere, Copycat, and the Relieve Monster Jump Ultra Rare. Open it to see if you have a potential PSA 10 worthy copycat or keep it sealed. Whew, yeah. We uh, don't really keep stuff sealed here very well, so you know what we're about to do. This is a Shonen Jump Pack. Okay, this is pretty sick. All right, Shonen Jump Pack, limited edition. Obviously, we're not keeping this sealed. This is one we did not open in our every pack opening, even though technically, you know, it's it's not really a booster pack because it does the same thing every time, so I don't feel bad. But let's open it up and check out these cards. These are jump promos, which is really cool. A cloning. That's really cool. Let's sleeve these up. There's a little bit of stuff on the back. That's pretty nice, cloning. We got Relieve Monster. I think all these were Retro Pack Secrets. I know Relieve Monster was. I think Cloning was as well. So they were Jump and then they made them. Yep, these were Retro Pack. These are all Retro Pack Secrets. Copycat was a Retro Pack Secret. Re secret retro Pack 1. So Copycat, that's super cool. And a Blast Sphere is also a Retro Pack Secret. Re that's pretty funny. 
So they, that's pretty much where retro pack secrets come from or jump usually. That is a really cool booster pack. So thank you for throwing that in. That's really awesome. That was actually some really cool stuff. And of course the sacred cards, which is really cool to get three of those. We'll, we'll definitely, I think, have to open at least one of them, you know, to see the promos. By the way, the promos inside are the Perfectly Ultimate Great Moth, Negate Attack, and Ryoku. We have two more packages. All right, this is um interesting. <laughs> interesting packaging, but there aren't top loaders, so we're probably going to be all right. All right, what do we get here? I can't even remember. Yeah, they slid up, so. Oh, Gears to the Orcus Mech Knight. Okay, new card. Pretty valuable, I think. I can't remember. I'll pop the price up. Oh, some of these are new. Some of them are not. We have... Oh, TP6 Royal Decree. That's pretty cool. I actually have this in PSA 10, which is cool. I have it in, four, in TP4 and TP6 in 10. Air Knight from DB2. That's cool. Nice go card. Snatch Steel MRL. That's pretty cool. Magic Ruler version. Yeah, these I traded for some, some Pokemon commons. Man, Mystic Swordsman level 7. That's pretty cool. Let's check out the condition on this guy. Oof. Not great, not great. Probably like moderate play, probably. Maybe a little bit better. Not fantastic. I can't remember what condition they were supposed to be in. I feel like it was better than that, but that's okay. Invader of Darkness, that's pretty cool. Secret Rare, first edition. That's pretty nice. It looks like it's uh, VLP, it's not too bad. Let's have a little corner ding, a little bit of back scuffing. We have Fallen of Albaz, that's a secret rare from Rise of the Duelist, and a BLS from Invasion of Chaos, that's pretty cool. And this is not a reprint, it looks like. Blackluster Soldier, Envoy of the Beginning. That's pretty cool. This guy definitely should have been a secret rare instead of Invasion of Chaos. Or not Invasion of Chaos. Invasion of... Invader! Invader! Invader of Darkness. Yeah, that definitely would have made more sense. So that's pretty cool. So thank you for that. That's awesome. Those are really, really nice. All right, final package. This one is from... Philip Baker. I think this is like a custom booster box of Judgment of the Light. He was showing me pictures of it. So I have no idea what we're about to expect. This is probably going to be pretty funny. All right. This is the last item of this mail day. So buckle up. All right. First of all, right off the top, we've got multiple Marolche Chocolate. Chocolate. So that's a good start. That's a very good start. Oh, there's another one. Lots of them. So that's a great, fantastic, amazing Judgment of the Light start. Now we have some packs. Is that what this is? Like booster packs? So he has made us a booster box. So I don't know what's going to happen here, but we're going to go like this. And we have a ba an entire pack. Three, six, nine. We now have... Okay, that's nine chicken lattes. Time out. Okay, we got to count this. I need card savers now. So if anybody is trying to hook me up with some card savers, you would be awesome. I have zero. And I would like to sub some stuff, and I don't want to send it in top loaders. I'm a little scared to do that. But apparently you're allowed to, but it feels a little sketchy. All right, so we have like 19 chicolates already. Whoops. Wonder what, wonder what these could be. A custom booster box of a chicolates. Three, six, nine more chicolates. What is that, 28 chicolates? Oh my goodness. Where in the world did he get all these chicolates? One, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, that's 37 Chica Lattes. By the way, these cards are extremely rare. Where did he find all of these? The most powerful Chica Lattes packed of all time. Oh my, we're about to have like 100 Chica Lattes. Oh my goodness. There's so many of them. The Chica Latte, Chica Chica Latte. Get the Lattes out of Booster Boxes. Because the Chica Lattes are my Chica Lattes. Okay, yep. Yeah. We need, to, we need to remix the Chicolates song. Look at all these Chicolates. I have a monopoly on Chicolates now. Just letting you know. The price for Chicolates is now $1 million. You know why? Because I own all of them. Chicolates. The greatest. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> like I, Somebody sent me the ultimate deck with 40 Chicolates. I still have those over there. 
And now I have, like, what? A hundred Chicolates? Like, we're gonna have to do a Chicolates counter at the end. <laughs> oh my goodness. The booster box! The best booster box of all time. Can you possibly beat this booster box? Yeah, if I name this this video best booster box of all time, you think that it would uh you think people would be angry? Well, I put best deck of all time or greatest deck of all time or something on that uh Chicolates one. And people were actually, you know, they were fine with it. They thought it was funny. And I don't know why you think it's funny because it was the best deck of all time. So I mean I don't even understand the problem, but yeah, I don't know. It seemed like it was it seemed like people were for some reason they didn't believe that Chicolates was the greatest deck of all time. This is crazy. All right, we still got half the booster box. So what is this? Nine times 24? Is that how many packs are in here? What would that be? Nine times 24 is 180 plus, what's uh, 36? So 216 Chicolates plus the like, what do we start with? Like 11 or something? No, it's 19. So 116. So it makes 235 Chicolates in here. This booster box contained 235 Chicolates. I just, I just want y'all to think about that. I own 235 of the rarest card in the world. 235 just from this box, not to mention the 40 from that deck I got. This is absolutely awesome. The Chicolates, the greatest and most powerful. Let's see. You know what we really need is a hollow Chicolates. Why is there not a hollow Chicolates, you ask? I don't know. You know what we need is our Chicolates mat. That's what we needed out here. That definitely should be used in all viewer mail videos because you know you're going to get a good dose of Chicolates and possibly Pequeno Moth. Just depends. I can't wait till we open up that first edition Pequeno Moth out of the first edition booster box. That's all I'm saying. All you have to do is get us 35,000 subscribers. We're opening up a $5,000 Metal Raiders first edition booster box. It's going to be insane. I cannot wait. Final booster pack of this epic box is more Chicolates. Okay, just want to show you guys how many Chicolates we now have. This is the Chicolate stack. Bruh. So, Philip Baker, thank you. This is an incredible gift. The Chicolates will be appreciated, loved, sang to with the Chicolate song. That's it for today, guys. I'll see you guys later. Chicolates. Elemental Hero Dark Bright Boom! Oh. <laughs>